Hi, and welcome to M. Roller's Geeky and Sweet Creations, and today we're making these cute peacock ornaments. Cute, right? And you can hang them on your tree or give them as gifts for the holidays, so let's get started. Okay, what you need is sequences for uh, three different colors. I got blue, purple, and green, but you can get whatever colors you want. I got these at Michael's for like one dollar. Um, next you need air dry clay. You'll know what color it is in this little circle. I got royal blue and white. Um, I got these about three dollars at Michael's. Then you'll need blue feathers. They actually said plum, but they're blue. You see, they're blue. And um, I got these about two dollars at Michael's. Then you need white rose petals, not real ones, fake ones. And I got these for free recycling, of course. Um, then you need pine cones. I got these outside where you normally get pine cones, but you can buy them at Michael's. And then nail polish. This is old nail polish, so I'm just reusing it. So let's get started. Okay, first what you do is you take out your, your clay. See, I have white and I have blue. Let me just stick it where you guys can see it. And then what you do is you knead it. You know, you pull it, so there's not really air, and you get a bang for your buck. And then after you're done kneading it, what you do is you will shape them into peacock heads. And I'll show you what mine look like after I do that. Here's my blue head, and here's my white. Okay, here comes the optional part. You take one of these black teardrop beads and you use them as a beak or you can just make one out of clay. Um, sometimes you can just stick them on there or sometimes you'll need to like put um, clear nail polish on the back so they'll stick. So do that. Okay, um, I put the beaks on. The white peacock looks like. This is what the blue peacock looks like. They kind of look like bird heads now. You may not agree now, but they will. They'll look like it now. So now what we do is we take our pine cones and we color it. You can use paint, but I'm using nail polish for the blue. I'm using this gold color. And for the white, I'm going to use um, a grayish color with a sparkly on it. But you can also just paint it and then buy sprinkles and it'll be sparkly that way. Um, I say just color the first half part of the pine cone. So from this up, I'd color it. And then after you're done with that, I'll show you the next step. Okay, what I did was I stuck the head onto the pine cone. As you see, this is the painted side up. The blank side is where you put the neck part and you just squish it down and kind of soften it. So, oops, so it looks like there's a body. Okay, here comes the feather part. For the blue one, you'll for the blue peacock, you'll need three blue feathers. For the middle tail, you'll, it'll have a flat tail like this. For the, for the wings, you just want to make the tail part of the wing just like that. Just cut it to make it have more like a pointy edge on it. For the for the white peacock, you'll use these white petals, and you see how they're attached. You just cut off individual petals, and you put them 
on your peacock. So I'll show you what the peacocks look like after you put on the feathers. This is what it looks like with the feathers on. You, for like smaller ones, you might want shorter feathers. Um, you can add optional feathers. I sometimes use um, optional black feathers. See, like on this one, and I put like gold circles and sequences on that. But you can just put more blue ones on it and then just keep the blue peacocks blue. And then for the white peacocks, the white peacocks look like this. You can use up to five feathers. This one has four feathers on it. But that's what it looks like. And then for the white peacocks, you just put sequences on the top of the white petals. So the last step is of course decorating the rest of the face. Um, I'm just going to put a gold streak. So what I do, if you guys can see, is what I'm doing is I'm going to put a circle of gold and I'm going to streak it down all the way down to its body like this. And it adds a good kind of gold um, attraction to it. And uh, that would be the last step. Okay, here's our finished prod po product. As I said, the black feathers are optional. And this guy has a head feather. That's optional too. You can make them however you want. Here's my white peacock. He has a black head feather, optional. You don't have to put the sequences where I put the sequences. You can put them wherever you want and you can replace sequences with glitter. And remember, you can recycle all this stuff and you can go outside and get the pine cones for free. So, uh, spend cheaply and, um, go to my website, which will be in the description below. And leave me comments for what other crafts you want me to do. And I'll make sure that you can do these crafts as cheaply as possible. Thanks for coming to see this project. And I hope to see you the next one. Okay.